Well, back in February, Baltimore's mayor announced the public safety initiative called Operation Ceasefire, an effort to identify and target violent crime offenders in the Western District. The police and their law enforcement partners say their efforts are working and today highlighted what they're calling an incredible drug bust. 11 News I team reporter Lisa Robinson joins us live from City Police Headquarters with more on the story. Lisa? Stan, the man arrested in this bust was given the opportunity to get out of the game. He didn't, so police took him down. It's a lot of money, isn't it? A lot of drugs. You're looking at $825,000 in cash and 11.5 kilograms of raw heroin. On the street, that's worth $3 million. That also equates to violence, shootings, murders on our streets. Police made this seizure when they served a search warrant in the 2500 block of Oakley Avenue around 8.40 Thursday evening. They arrested 41-year-old Sean Hearn, a convicted felon who police say was a major supplier of heroin in the Monroe Street corridor in West Baltimore. Taking this money off, taking these criminals off, taking these drugs off of our streets will ensure that we will reduce the violence and the level of harm done within the city. Baltimore City Police Commissioner Anthony Batts says Hearn was taken down as part of Operation Ceasefire in the Western District. Police identify the most violent individuals in the area, bring them in, and tell them they know what they're up to, then offer to help them get out of the game. We identified to them what services, what wraparound services the city could provide in order to help them. Our goal is to help them get out of this criminal life that they had. Our goal is to, to help them stop the cycle of violence in our community. Police say Hearn was given that chance, but didn't take it. They say he's an example of what will happen to those who do not buy in. We're going to come after you where you live. We're going to come after you where you work and do your dirty deeds. Now, because of this Operation Ceasefire, police have come up with a list of 574 people who are at high risk for committing homicides, and shootings or being killed or shot themselves. Reporting live at police headquarters, Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News. Massive drug bust. Baltimore City Police arrest this man, Sean Hearn, after they say they found a shocking amount of drugs and money in his home. Police seized 12 kilograms of heroin and $825,000 from the residence on Oakley Avenue. The bust is part of the Operation Ceasefire program. The program encourages community members to work with police to confront criminals. We'll have much more on this story coming up at 5 and 6. A big drug bust to tell you about in Baltimore City tonight. Police seized 12 kilograms of heroin and $825,000. Sean Hearn was charged in the bus. Police made the announcement of the seizure at a news conference this morning. Now, the bust apparently stems from the Operation Ceasefire program announced back in February by Mayor Stephanie Rawlings Blake. The program encourages community members to work with police to confront criminals. You can hear much more about this, including reaction from the police commissioner coming up tonight at 6 on In Focus. We're putting the effort to make our city safer in focus tonight. The city says Operation Ceasefire is a useful tool to help combat violence in Baltimore City. Today, the police commissioner called a news conference to show just how it's making progress. Kelly, Operation Ceasefire is a complicated program shrouded in anonymity in order for it to work. But in lay terms, some repeat violent offenders are targeted and offered a way out of their criminal lifestyle by law enforcement. It is when those targets don't take that deal, it triggers the full force of the Baltimore City Police Department. Today, Commissioner Anthony Batts talked about one of those cases. Sean Antonio Hearn didn't pay attention to the overtures the police department made, didn't take them up on the opportunity to wipe the slate clean and live a straight life. So the police department's special enforcement section ceasefire team swooped in and made, a good on, made good on its word by serving a warrant and seizing quite the haul from Hearn's operation. Last night, our enforcement efforts came to bear on the individual who decided not to get out of violence as we provided a pathway out. At 8.40 p.m., our special enforcement section ceasefire team executed a search warrant in the 2600 block of Oakley. $825,000 was taken in. 11.5 kilograms of raw heroin. That equates to $3 million in worth. That also equates to violence, shootings, murders on our streets. 
Now, Commissioner Batts laid it all out on the table for the television cameras and was holding up this arrest as an example that Operation Ceasefire is working here in Baltimore. The commissioner also credits a 47% drop in homicides in the Western to the work of his ceasefire team.